Hold on there a minute, young fella. What was the meaning of that outburst I just heard? And the mean things you said to Big John? He was mean to me first. Let me see if I can patch this together. I'm tired of your idea. The young girl gets yelled at by her father and made to feel stupid. Can you count to two? She probably feels angry, but it probably doesn't feel safe to show that to her father, so... Here's your food, you stupid dog. She finds someone smaller she can pick on. You mean me? Mm-hmm. So then you go to class and goof up and get called names by a dog that should have finished that kind of class a long time ago. Elephant ears. <laughs> he finds something different about you and makes nasty remarks in order to make himself feel a little better by making you feel a little worse. And you turn around and say mean things to your good friend, Big John. What's going on around here? None of your business. Why don't you just look where you're going? You, 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 you baloney brain, buck tooth head. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. Is that so? When Melissa called you stupid, did it hurt? Uh-huh. And when Grizzle said you had ears like an elephant, did that hurt? Uh-huh. So, when you say mean things to people, because you're feeling hurt, don't you think it would hurt them too? Psst. Hey, Bax, old boy. Do you think your certificate's going to say dog training class or elephant training class? <laughs> if you think you're going to feel better by making me feel bad, I've got some bad news for you. When you call me names, I do feel angry, but I don't feel bad. I like myself too much to waste my time doing that. Well, excuse me. <clears throat> I'll consider it. 